News tonight, display dispute. New on the night team, some neighbors are unhappy with a popular Christmas display in Charlestown, saying it's too bright and draws too much traffic. The night team's Daniel Kennedy spoke with the man behind it all. Dan and Patrice David Lamb has been putting up this elaborate holiday display for several years, but says he's toning it down this year after some neighbors complained. <laughs> The sounds and sights of Christmas or a labor of love. It takes me about a month to get this all together for David Lamb. And I do it all on my own. All dedicated to his late wife who loved the spirit of Christmas. We've been together for 30 plus years. She died in 2016. Every December since 1991. I like how it goes along to the rhythm of the music. The cars line up along Route 91 in Charlestown. At one time, did probably Anywhere from 15 to maybe 20 cars out here. A big problem for some neighbors. It gets me upset. Lamb says some have complained his display is a public nuisance and a safety hazard. The head of the building department told NBC 10 some have even accused him of violating the town's dark sky ordinance, which officials say he hasn't. I understand the traffic issue. That's all understandable. You know, but I mean, that's stuff we can work through. Down the street, now a sign warning drivers to watch for pedestrians. A police cruiser also in front of Lamb's home. He says he's even turned down the brightness to cooperate and keep the tradition alive. I have parents who brought their kids and their kids are now bringing their kids. A positive light for some in the neighborhood. We live close by and we must come at least 10 times. It's just beautiful and he puts a lot of work into it. That Lamb says he hopes will keep shining. I just want to keep it going. This is what I do. Lamb says he's going to continue putting up the holiday display and says he won't take it down unless he's forced to. In Charlestown, I'm Danielle Kennedy, NBC 10 News 19.